Porsche hat so angefangen. Porsche mit started out with a four-cylinder boxer engine. Back then in the 356, in the 550 Spider and in the 718 of course. And hence the name now. That was a conscious decision. The typical Porsche sound is immediately recognizable. Ja, wir hatten das Ziel Now, our objective was to further increase performance in comparison to its predecessor, while at the same time reducing fuel consumption. And of course, the turbo concept is ideal for this, as the increase in performance due to turbocharging simultaneously allows the number of cylinders to be reduced from six to four cylinders, further decreasing internal friction in the engine and thus cutting consumption. Fuel consumption is reduced by up to 13%. The fuel consumption of the base model is 6.9 liters per 100 kilometers, which corresponds to the savings of 0.7 liters per 100 kilometers. The Cayman S has a fuel consumption of 7.3 liters, which corresponds to a savings of 0.9 liters per 100 kilometers. The B4 is a completely new engine. It came into being together with a new engine family that includes the 3.0 liter six cylinder boxer engine that is used in the 911 Carrera. Carrera einsetzen. Ja, die besondere Herausforderung für den Cayman a particular challenge for the Cayman was designing the B4 engine in such a way that it would fit into the space available, along with all of its components. The charge air cooling system posed a particular challenge, and we definitely aimed to make the side air inlets as they are today, without then needing to make any major alterations in the body. For the Cayman and the Cayman S, we opted for engines of different displacements in order to achieve an optimum balance between good throttle response and maximum performance. We refer to this as right-sizing, because the higher naturally aspired torque of the 2.5-liter engine, with its special tuning, especially at the lower end, is accompanied by even better throttle response. The new B4 engine is based on the Porsche Modular Technology Kit, which also has a number of things in common with the 919 hybrid. In the Cayman S, we use the turbocharger with variable turbine geometry to achieve an optimum balance between maximum performance and optimum throttle response. This is a technology that actually originated in diesel engines and has already been established there for a long time. Until now, it's been exclusively reserved for the 911 Turbo. In the B4 engine, it is now also being used with an additional technology, namely an additional wastegate. The additional wastegate allows us to run the turbocharger at an optimum operating point at large mass flow rates. The new B4 engines in the 718 Cayman have several things in common with the 919 hybrid. Take, for example, the number of cylinders, four cylinders, the displacement, two liters, as well as the cylinder spacing of 118 millimeters, which is identical. Now, the new B4 engine is based on the Porsche modular technology kit, which also has a number of things in common with the 919 hybrid. They include direct fuel injection with a central injector position, as well as the use of variable turbine geometry for turbocharging. For the new B4 engines, we've taken the Vario Cam Plus system to the next level. We added variable cam tuning on the intake and now also on the outlet side. Over and above that, we implemented valve switching on both the inlet as well as the outlet side. The reason for this is that the adjacent cylinders have a negative impact on each other in the B4 as residual gases from one cylinder can enter the next cylinder, which would have a negative impact on torque buildup. Valve switching allows us to reduce this residual gas entry to a minimum, enabling us to achieve optimum torque at low engine speeds. The transmissions were adapted to the new turbo engines. On the one hand, we worked on the details in various places, such as changing the material used for the ball joint flanges and optimizing the internal lubrication of the manual transmission. Coatings were optimized here and there. 
We are using a new clutch for the manual transmission, and we're using a new centrifugal pendulum for two mass flywheels for both the manual transmission as well as for the PDK transmission. The Cayman and Cayman S already have their very own characteristic sound, even with the standard exhaust system. It was deliberately tuned in such a way using specific asymmetries, both in the exhaust manifold as well as in the main silencer. In addition to this, customers can also order the optional sport exhaust system, which intensifies the emotional driving experience and the sound even more. What sets us apart from the competition are, of course, the unique sound of the Boxer engine, as well as the unique high revving capability of the turbo engine of up to 7,500 RPM. 